Hey everyone, I'm here with the CEO of Capital Metro, Randy Clark. He's walking us through some exciting things that the agency has going on. Okay, so we talked a little bit about the electric bus yard. So walk viewers uh, through some other uh, uh, exciting things that are gonna be a part of that project. Yeah, one, one other thing that we've done really, we, and we're always trying to push innovation here at Cap Metro, and I think that thematically works in Austin, which is such a tech town. So uh, typically you have a, a bus that's charged by its own charger. So we have Proterra buses charged by Proterra chargers and New Flyer uh, vehicles that are charged by Siemens chargers. We were the first ever in North America to actually interoperably charge across manufacturer. So that is a really big thing because, uh, you know, you take a bus of that size, it's kind of like a, it's like four or five Teslas inside that vehicle, you know, it's, it's an incredibly powerful bus that has to operate all day long and run all these systems. So fast charging that and having the interoperability is a really big deal, not just for us, but for our industry. So, uh, I'm, you know, one of the things that we're committed to is trying to continually advance technology because this is pretty high tech stuff. So uh, that, that's a big deal to have this first in the country uh, innovation done. It's just, I, I think it's great that our agency now has really got this innovation bug, trying to push things in a different way, so. It'll be a game changer, that's for sure, in helping not only our pollution, but uh, taking a huge chunk of traffic from the roads when we start to get to those pre-pandemic levels again.